Good morning, Light of Jericho members and visitors. You know, I'm so excited today because we're all on one accord, praising our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. I'm also excited today because right now I'm standing in the Hilton Hotel right by the airport. And you know, they're getting prepared for us for the 17th, where we're going to be celebrating our pastor's 30th anniversary. So we want you to do your part and get your tickets today. They're only $40. So don't miss out on celebrating at this wonderful location on the 17th of March. Here are your Sunday morning announcements. Married couples, you're invited for a night out here at the Light of Jericho on February 24th. 2012 at 7 p.m. Come revisit your vows, play games, win prizes, and fellowship with others. Friday, February 24th at 7 p.m. We'll see you there. See Sister Banks or Reverend Tatum for more information. Come celebrate our pastor's 30th anniversary, Reginald D. Rogers, 30 years right here at the Light of Jericho Missionary Baptist Church. For more information, see Sister Sharon Brady or Reverend Jason Johnson. At the age of 27, Elizabeth Bessie Coleman became interested in aviation after hearing the exciting stories from soldiers returning from World War I. In 1920, Bessie flew to Paris to go to aviation school since America did not allow African Americans to attend flight school. In 1921, she returned to the States being the first person ever to receive an international pilot's license, giving her the ability to fly anywhere in the world. Bessie Coleman was a courageous, determined, and inspiring African-American woman. This has been your Black History Moment. We thank you so much. God bless each and every one of you. This has been your Sunday morning announcements. Be blessed. I belong to you. You belong to me.